Hi friends, I'm Anita from Maine Project Learning Tree and we're going to be doing an activity today called Schoolyard Safari. But I know a lot of us aren't at school today or maybe you're homeschooled. So instead of doing a schoolyard safari, I'm going to be doing a backyard safari area. So what I'm going to do is go around and I'm going to look in the different habitats to figure out what I can discover. When we think about habitat, a habitat is basically a place where animals live. And in order to survive, we have to have food, water, shelter, and space. If you have those things, then hopefully an animal would be able to survive in that particular habitat. At my house, I have some woods, I have a little wet area, and I have my lawn. So I'm going to wander around and see what I can discover. While I'm doing that, I'm going to use a paper from the Project Learning Tree site and see what I can find. So before I go, I'm going to actually make some predictions. What do I think I'm going to be able to find? Well, I'm hearing lots of birds right now, so maybe I can find some bird homes or actually see the birds. I am being surrounded by a bunch of mosquitoes. So maybe in the pond I can find some mosquito larvae. I also know that right now there's a lot of wildflowers, so maybe I can find some of them or even some of the nectar collectors like bees or butterflies. This is the chart that I got off plt.org called Schoolyard Safari. It says when you see or hear something in the boxes, you can X that box. Try to find four in a row. Remember, leave all natural stuff behind and only remove litter that doesn't belong. So these are some of the things I'm, I'm going to be looking for when I'm out doing my own backyard safari today. was a really fun adventure around my own backyard and let's see if we can figure out what kinds of things I found when I went on my schoolyard or my backyard safari and I'm just going to use some natural items I have some pine cones I have a cap from an acorn I've got a stick I can break pieces off to see if I manage to get a bingo. So I found some wildflowers. I found the hiding critter, the worm that I found in my compost pile. Didn't find any snails or slugs yet. And I haven't seen any waterfowl, but I definitely heard one. So I'm going to add that there. I didn't see frogs, turtles, or snakes, but I saw the ripples when one jumped into the pond at my house. I've seen some animal signs. I saw the source of water at my little pond. I have my nectar collector. Definitely uh, seeds and pine cones right there. I found my mini beasts. Lots of sun catchers popping out today in the sunshine. Listen, can you hear at least three different natural sounds? One, two, three. Yup, right there. Something that didn't belong here. Well, not in my yard, but I've definitely seen some of that out in the trails. 
that I've been on. Animal homes, yep, found those. That ant home. Didn't see an itsy bitsy eight-legged spider, but I did see a nest and three different tree species. Looks like I got lots of bingos. How did you do at your own house?